Suspected of corruption, abuse of power, fraud, and money laundering, Prime Minister Ehud Olmert is now being recommended for indictment by Israeli police. The decision follows several months of interrogations and investigations in which the Prime Minister is accused of having accepted large sums of money and monetary favors from American businessman Moshe Talansky. Info Live TV descended on the streets of Israel's capital city of Jerusalem to speak with the Israeli public about what they think the Prime Minister should do. אני במקום ראש הממשלה הייתי מתפטרת בצורה מיידית. זה ממש לא ראוי שהוא ימשיך לכהן ברגע שאפילו יש חשד לחוסר חפותו. As the Kadima primaries rapidly approach and both Likud and Labor gear up for their own attempts at taking power, we asked Israelis who they hoped would be the next Prime Minister of the Jewish State. I wanted to be Shaul Mufaz. I think he was the most good thing to be. Let's see. In the United States, it's only Bibi Netanyahu. Benjamin Netanyahu. Because he has the courage to say the truth before all the world. I think that... שרת החוץ היא מתאימה, ציפי לבני. אם תהיה ראש ממשלה עם ביקורת של איכות השלטון ועם מבקרת עמידה צמודה, אולי ציפי לבני. While the political career of Ehud Olmert seems to be forever tarnished by the corruption and bribery charges bringing his term to an early end, Olmert is still expected to remain at his post until a new government is formed after the Kadima primaries, which could take several weeks. His successor will then have 42 days to assemble a parliamentary majority and form a government, which will hopefully enjoy more popular support than Israel's current administration.